What up YouTube? Today I'm going to show you the things that you need to turn your desktop or laptop into a super fly editing machine. If you do a lot of video editing or a little video editing or you just want to make your life easier and have all the dopest shit for editing videos, check out the links in the description below and everything that I'm going to show you today. It's linked up to Amazon, cheapest place to get all this so, stuff. So let's get right into it. The first thing that I absolutely have to, have to praise that I have that I just love is the Shuffle Pro V2. And basically what this thing does is there's two different knobs right here. This knob and then this one has different settings depending on how much I turn it. You can turn it just a little or a lot and that fast forwards through your clips. And then the middle one will make it go frame by frame. And then also all these other little buttons you can program to do whatever you want to do. You can set it up for also doing photo editing. Um, you can use it on a Mac and Windows, you can use it with any of the editing programs, um, at least the three you know major editing programs, Vegas, Final Cut, and Adobe Premiere. Super easy to set up, just plugs into your USB, like, and you can change whatever you want these buttons to be. And they even come with little labels. I just haven't put them in yet. So like this is play, that'll, this'll take us back, play, back, and then as you can see right here, see the way I just do it a little bit? It's kind of like a DJ thing. And then I can go like frame by frame, which is so nice whenever I go in the middle. It goes frame, frame by frame. So yeah. That's linked up in the description below. Costs about like 100 bucks, I think. They also make a, um, uh, a scaled down model that still has the knob. I don't think it, it's not as big and I don't think it's quite as comfortable contour. I would suggest going with this one. Um, just, you know, it's, it's like, I think like 60 or 70 bucks and this one's like 100. Next thing, a super dope custom keyboard for whatever editing software you use. This right here is outfitted for Sony Vegas. And they also make them, the same company makes them for uh, Adobe Premiere and Final Cut Pro. And this is a USB keyboard. It even comes with this uh, clear cover and it also lights up. I don't know if you can tell. Peep that out. That it, they, it, the, it has like, it's backlit. And then it comes with this clear um, deal to protect the, the keys or whatever. Um, I smoke also, so sometimes I'll just be editing away in here and I'll forget to ash and then the ash gets in the keyboard. So that plastic cover is like uh, kind of, I was really excited. I didn't even know it came with that when I got it. It also has two extra USB ports, one right here and one right here. So I got my Shuffle Pro plugged into this one and then you could plug in if you have a wireless mouse that up there or this will also be linked up in the description below a USB mini SD reader peep this out you just leave that plugged in and then it's just right there on your uh, you know desk where you can get to it hella easy turn back on the light here and then uh, yeah pretty sick all right, the next thing, gotta have the dual monitor set up. These are the LG ultra wide monitors. You don't necessarily need the curved monitors. Actually, if I was gonna do it again, I would maybe even get, um, I'd probably get a third monitor. And I think I'm still gonna do that. With these curved monitors, 
the dual the dual monitor setup kind of sucks with the curved monitors you really need three and um what i had before this is the 25 inch um 21 uh by nine ultra wide lg um monitors two of them and a really dope thing about that is I actually exited out of the program, but hang on a second here and I'll show you. It usually always, you know, just pops up down there in the window like this. Check this out. So if you're only running one of these, you can adjust the screen like if you want to go half and half see that pretty sick so you can run since this monitors uh, so big this is like a 34 inch um, display and it's an ultra wide you can have two windows on the same monitor if you only want to get one pretty sick and there's tons of different you know options as you sorry I don't know if you guys can see that so yeah, definitely um, pretty freaking cool. And then another awesome thing about these is they have two USB plugs in the back as well. Always nice to have US, extra USBs. They got two HDMIs and then it also has the DP in as well. And if you're wondering what kind of mount I have, it's a Logitech. Some cool things about it are, I don't really want to misadjust these, but you can put them, you know, wherever you want. You can tilt that. I don't really want to mess it up that much, to be honest with you, but yeah, it just goes, you know, like up and down. So, yeah. I'll have both those monitors, my old ones, like anything over 34 inches is honestly like too big for video editing. Ideally, I almost like the 25 inch ultra wide monitors just as much in some aspects, but I don't know. I mean, it's hard to say. I'm, uh, I'm definitely a fan, but they can definitely be, get to the point where they're too big, you know, when you're sitting um, in front of them, so. The next thing that's super awesome is these USB um, basically plugs that plug into your computer. Then you got tons of extra USBs, you know, right on your desk. Usually I got all kinds of cables hooked in to charge all my camera shit. Um, another thing that I thought was pretty cool is just a little phone holder. And it's even got more USBs in it. So you can have your, you know, your phone upright um, whenever you're working so you don't miss any calls. So, oh, also got the sit and stand desk, which I think is pretty dope. So, yeah, I'm just making sure I didn't forget anything. Oh, yeah, let me show you the box for this keyboard. And I'll show you this keyboard's pretty expensive. This keyboard right here. This is like 130 bucks, which is a lot for a keyboard. But this is the dopest keyboard I've ever bought. Look at how sick just the box is. It's got a little magnet on it and everything. Oh. So, yeah, I don't know. I mean, it's one of those things where if you're editing a lot, like, you know, and on the computer, and, you know, you're making money at it or you're planning on editing